you have a Chromecast with Google TV and you have an issue with your remote where it's not working properly, maybe you have one button or several buttons not working, maybe the uh, trackpad here is not working, or maybe when you move to the right, it's hesitating, it's a slow response, it takes like two, three, four seconds instead of like as soon as you click it, it should move to the right. Or maybe you just have one button like the YouTube book button or the volume buttons or power button, even the source button not working. I'm gonna give you several solutions to get you up and running right now. So the first thing I want to note is if you have issues with your volume control, power button, or input or source button not working, the source is here, power is here, and volume uh, controller is here. If those are not working, then it's possible that you need to go ahead and pair it, okay? So first thing is let's, let's make sure that you have all your buttons paired, okay? So just go to home, and then from here you want to go all the way up and move all the way to the right to your photo avatar, move all the way, and then move down to settings or the uh, gear icon, go ahead and click on uh, the OK button on the remote. And then from here, we're gonna move all the way down to remote and accessories. So go ahead and enter, click on there. And then we're gonna go ahead up here, pair remote and accessory, go ahead and, or actually, oh, sorry, you wanna go down to setup buttons. This is control volume, power, input on TV, receivers, and sound bar. So we wanna go all the way down here, okay? So let me go ahead and click on the OK on the button. Now take note, you can see under, I have Roku TV. Now this TV here, this is a, a TCL Roku TV. Now when I first tried to pair the remote, it wouldn't work because I had it on TCL TV. However, because this is a TCL Roku TV, what I had to do was just go to Add Devices and I just found Roku TV and now everything works. Okay, once you go to Roku TV, uh, you select that. Then you wanna go to the right and you wanna go to Setup Buttons and then click on OK. And then you just want to go ahead and read the instructions here, you know, the volume here. Um, just go ahead and read through it, okay? You have to do e each one for the power, volume, as well as the input. Even the input here or source button here works as well as you can see right here, okay? Okay, so next thing is, okay, now we know that you got those buttons like paired. Next thing is go ahead and turn your TV on. And now what I want you to do is go ahead and pull the power plug, okay, while the TV is on. Go ahead and just pull the plug out just like this. Wait 30 seconds after 30 seconds. Go ahead and plug it back in. Turn your TV on. Start up your Google TV and see if your remote is working properly. If it's still down, we're going to go to the next solution. Next thing is going to grab your remote. And what we're going to do is we're going to pull out the batteries. So let's take the batteries out. Okay, so after you take your batteries out, first thing I want you to do is with the power button here, I want you to press and hold it for 15 seconds. Press and hold the power for 15 seconds. No batteries in there. After 15 seconds, go ahead and let go. Now what I want you to do is spam every single button in here, okay? The OK button, the trackpad, every single button, even the source button, uh, the power button, even the volume rockers, okay? Just keep on pressing, because what happens is if you use these like long enough and you get like sweat or hand lotion or any kind of soda or coffee in there or even dust, if one button, there's an issue with one button, it can cause other issues somewhere else, okay? So just keep doing this, make everything all nice and loose. Give it a couple, give it a couple wax. Pop the batteries back in and don't put the back lid on. Just pop the batteries back in and see if your remote is working correctly. If it's still down, then do, do it again. Go ahead and pop out the batteries. Press and hold this power button for 15 seconds. Don't let go for 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, let go. Again, start spamming every single button on here. Get it all nice and loose. Even the volume rockers, don't forget. Give it a couple wax. Pop the batteries back in and then see if your remote is working. Now, if it's still down, Go ahead and try this same step again, okay? Pull out the batteries, press and hold the power button 15 seconds. Try that up to six times. If you did this six times and your remote is still not working correctly, then the next thing is just go ahead and get um, another set of AAA batteries, okay? It doesn't necessarily have to be brand new batteries, just a different set, um, two different batteries, okay? Two different AAA batteries. Pop those in there and see if that works, okay? Now this easy fix is only going to help like 50% of you guys. So if this worked for you, give me a thumbs up. If it didn't, give me a thumbs down. We should see a 50-50 ratio. Good luck, guys.